So, what exactly do you think we'll be doing? Eh, what do you mean? You gotta be more specific. With tracking down the Scarlet Society? What else, cuz? Okay, okay, I get it. Well, I'm not completely sure. I know Lieutenant Matthew said something about training, but I don't know what that's going to be like. Maybe some sort of high-tech virtual reality training. That would be cool. Ugh, please, no. After being in the Society's horror simulator, I'll pass. Oh, right. I kind of forgot. <sighs> it's fine. You were dealing with your own horrors in the facility. You didn't see what the simulator was like. Yeah, it was a different kind of scary for us. I I still remember when Kay charged into that room with her arm bleeding like crazy. It caught me off guard and I think I had another reality check. Remembered how desperate our situation was. But I've heard you talk about the simulations before. They were bad, right? It, yeah. Wastelands, complex mazes that made your brain hurt, weird, overgrown labs, and then the glitches. The simulator glitched like crazy. We tried all sorts of things and got separated multiple times. It, it was scary. But, it's all over now. Everything related to the facility is over. Well, not completely over. We're still dealing with the Scarlet Society. And- Guys, come on! Huh? Huh? We're going to be starting our training in 10 minutes, and you guys have got to see the training area. Oh, okay, yeah, let's go. Right behind you, cuz. Well, Mom, the doctors say you'll be up soon. Any day now. I mean, you've been recuperating for a while anyway. You'll be able to join us in taking down the organization. Oh, right. I heard something earlier about training. I should probably find the others. Oh, hey, Ash. Hey, Eden. Visiting your mom? Yeah. Even though she's been fine for a while, I... I still get a little nervous. But she's getting better, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. She's going to be moved to a normal room later today. She won't be restricted to resting anymore. That's good to hear. Yeah. So, you ready to take down the organization? I think so. I'm a little apprehensive about what we're going to do, but... But it's for a worthy cause, you know? Oh, yeah, I do. I'm thankful that Zoe, Finn, and Kay are willing to help, too. At this point, they're like family to me. We've been through so much together, I- I get it. I feel the same way with Harper and Katrina. Heh, <laughs> you know, Katrina being the older, annoying sister, if we were to put it that way. Yeah. <laughs> What's wrong? R wrong Come on, Ian. I've known you long enough to know when something's bothering you. I... well... It's just, I'm worried about everyone. About, about someone getting hurt. Hurt? Yeah. I mean, this is the Scarlet Society, Ash. They, what if they capture one of us? Zoe, or Finn, Harper, what if they capture you? Well then, I'll make them regret it. I'm serious, Ash. It's partially why, why I wanted to be the only one working with the agency. Whoa, what? Eden, this is our fight, too. I know, I know. It's just... I don't want any of you getting hurt. Or... worse. Hey. Well, 
I can't promise that won't happen. I'm not really sure what's going to go down, but you're not facing the organization alone, Eden. We're here to stand by you. I'm here to stand by you. I... I really do appreciate that, Ash. Really, I do. But still, if you guys ever want to go find a normal life, then I won't hold it against you if you leave- I'm not leaving, Eden. I want the Scarlet Society to pay. I want to bring them down. So no way am I leaving. Besides, I have other reasons for staying. <laughs> oh, you do, huh? For sure. And they're just as solid, maybe even more so, as making the organization pay. You don't say. Seriously, Eden. I'm not leaving you anytime soon. You can count on it. Thanks, Ash. You're not too bad yourself. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, I... Oh, the, tr the the training! Ash, we better get going! Oh, right. I completely forgot about it. Because, you know, Eden, you can be... Okay, okay, enough, you! Now let's get going already. <laughs> sure, sure. Good morning, everyone. I hope you're well rested, because I can assure you that you'll need it in the upcoming days. As I said before, all of you are going to be trained in various different fields, mainly defensive combat, and maybe some offensive as well. We want you all to be ready and well equipped for anything the Scarlet Society may throw at you. That being said, basic weapons training will also be taught. Weapons? Yeah, no idea. I'd like to introduce you all to Agent Zarya Hale. Everyone calls me Zari, though. Agent Zari is our head of the Juvenile Squadron. You answer to her, and she will be training you all. All of us, huh? Believe me. I could take all of you if y'all try to subdue me. We'd all end up flat on your behinds. Right. I'm serious. As I said, you answer to Agent Zari. Respect is expected here. Any questionable behavior will not be tolerated. Define questionable. She seems kind of intense, right? Yeah... I'm going to let Agent Zari continue from here. If you have any questions, you may meet with me after lunch if I'm not already preoccupied. So... What exactly... Everyone, line up. Straight line. As Lieutenant Matthew Alice said, I will not, by any means, tolerate questionable behavior, disrespect, Poor sportsmanship, or... Girl, you're, like, my age. And yet, I'm above you in the ranks of this place. Get over yourself. You! Cat, stop. Remember, she doesn't tolerate disrespect. She's not gonna be tolerating a lot more once I... Katrina, please? Back in line. Both of you. I did not grant you permission to intervene. S sorry Yikes. Real drill, Sergeant, there, huh? Yeah. Listen, people! I want to see you doing defensive combat with each other by tomorrow. I have the worst deadline ever to whip you guys into shape. So let's move it. This'll be fun. Ugh, what's your definition of fun? Cat. This is going to be something else. Already, guys, 
I seriously didn't think I was this out of shape. <sighs> You're not the only one. One of the pluses of having this suit. Higher stamina. Yeah, sure. Rub it in, cat. Rub it in. What do you think, Eden? Yeah, what do you think of Agent Zari's methods? What do I think? Brutal. Simply brutal. Ugh. Her methods are... interesting. Ugh. Come on, Eden, you gotta give us more of an opinion than- I'm still just worried about everything. With the training we're receiving, I can't help but wonder what we're actually going to be doing out in the field. Like, how prepared do we have to be? Prepared? Please. We're far from prepared when it comes to these threads. Since when have you been a fashion expert? I'm not, but it's pure fact, really. That's true. You think they finally outfit us with proper attire and- Well, you guys at least. I, on the other hand... <laughs> really, Katrina, we get it. You have a high-tech suit. Yes, it exactly. It would be cool to get some new clothes or something. Then again, I might not want- I need everyone's attention. Lieutenant Matthew would like to meet you all as soon as you're done. Oh, but none of us have questions about- It's not about the training. It is... Someone in trouble? Already? Hybrids, I- Lieutenant Matthew will explain everything once you've met with him. Now, if you'll excuse me. Well, what do you think that's about? Part of me doesn't want to know. Come on, cuz. It can't be that bad, right? Let's hope so. Good afternoon, everyone. I hope this morning's training went well for you all. More? Today I've managed to bring in our stylist here at the base. Miss Silver outfits everyone here with the necessary attire for missions, whether it be disguises, mission wear, or... We're finally getting new with your heads! Yes! No more threadbare cardigan! And something more mission-ready. Miss Silver will take your measurements and then find appropriate attire. So, the question is, who's going first? Whoa. Whoa! Girl, you're slaying it! Thanks! Whoa. You look... amazing. <laughs> Thank you. You don't look too bad yourself, Ash. And thanks, I think. <laughs> Please, those two. Come on, Kat, admit it. They've got it going. Trust me, I know they've got it going. Okay, everyone, again. Seriously, I don't think I'm going to get used to this thing. <sighs> I know. It's kind of weird. Yikes. Okay, Phineas, you're going to have to- It's Finn, by the way. Not in this place, it's not. Try aiming the stun gun at the target. Composite for distance. It's pretty simple, like- See? The Katrina! Well done, Katrina! Wow, I finally did something right in her book. I wish I shared your enthusiasm. Part of this still scares me. Ugh, really? Everyone, fire again! Focus. Like, really focus on our goal and our reasons for doing this. Because if I don't, I think I'm going to lose myself all over again. And I don't want that. Definitely not. Eden, you have to have a steadier hand! Katrina? What? what do you want? I just wanted to see how you've been doing lately. How I've been doing? Well, yeah. I saw how well you did in weapons training earlier. <laughs> At least I know one of us isn't afraid to use a weapon. All about perspective, really. You want to live, right? Then you're gonna have to use the thing sooner or later. I know. I just... I've never handled a weapon before. Neither have I. So, us taking down the organization. You ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Are... are you sure you wind in on this? 
I know it's your fright and all, but... But don't you want to live a normal life now that you have the chance? I'm just curious and... <laughs> Eden, I can't live a normal life. Not with this monstrosity of a suit. I lost the opportunity ages ago. Oh, I'm... I I'm sorry, I... Forget it. I... I know I've said it before, I know I'm going to sound like a broken record, but I really am sorry for my dad endangering you all before. Really, I- he had no idea you, Harper, and Ash existed. If he did, I'm sure he would have tried to figure out another solution. Why are you saying this again? And all of a sudden? Well, whether we like it or not, we're going to be working together in taking down the Scarlet Society. And Katrina, I'll be honest. I want you on my side, so I guess what I'm saying is... Truce? Truce? Yeah, like, we'll try to let bygones be bygones. For the sake of the team. For the sake of our situation. I'm not saying we can't work things out later, but... At least right now, can we move on? Well, I... I guess. Why not? Ash and Harper accepted you a long time ago. <laughs> Especially Ash. Great. Thanks, Katrina. Really, I'm glad you're here with us. I'll let you get back to your thinking. Sure. See you around. Yeah. See you. You called, Lieutenant? Yes, I did. How's training going? As expected. Combat training is average. Weapons training could use some work. However, everyone's pretty good at invasive maneuvers. They're practicing as we speak. That's good to hear, because we have a bit of a problem. What is it? One of our agents just sent in his report saying he caught wind of a scarlet operative or two in a city nearby. However, because of his cover, he couldn't afford to stay any longer and investigate. What's his trail? It appears that the said operatives are going to be commuting out of the city. Where exactly? Well, we're not sure, since our agent already left. Oh, then can't we send someone else to tell them? I wish. Unfortunately, we're spread pretty thin right now, Zari. Majority of our agents are still following clues from the, the recent abandoned facility that the Jalaris came from. At the moment, we don't have been one to take the agent's place. There's a but, isn't there? Yes. I know they've received barely any training. However, you admitted yourself that they're decent in evasive action. I assume that includes counter-surveillance. Yes, I'd say more than decent in both fields. Surprisingly. Then, I'm considering giving them this assignment. We'll pair them up, of course. Obviously, I don't trust them going so long. Of course. Do you think you can have them ready in two days? I think I can. I can probably brush up their skills and weapons in combat as well. It'll be a tight schedule, but if this is our only option, it's manageable. <sighs> Good. Excellent. If you can start that now, I'd appreciate it. Of course, sir. You may leave. Did you really think I wouldn't hear? Sandra, I wasn't expecting- You're sending the kids out into the field. As much as I hate the circumstances, yes, I am. There are only resources right now. If you're willing to send teenagers with barely any training into the field, then I want to be sent as well. Sandra, you were only just moved from the recovery unit four hours ago. I can't- Yes, you can. Technically, I had more training than they do from when Eden and I stayed. Yes, I know. I know. What did you have in mind? I want to help with the clues from the facility. Give me a lead. Even make me pair up with another agent. But I want in on this fight, too. I've been resting in bed for far too long. I'm completely fine and recovered now. I am most certainly going to pair you up with someone else. Please, it's dangerous out there with the Scarlet Society doing who knows what. Like I said, I'm completely fine with that. I'm serious about this, Matthew. For too long, I've been hiding in the shadows, trying to ignore this whole mess. Well, now I want to help clean it up, whether you like it or not. You've proven your point, Sandra. No need to drive it in further. Good. Now when do I start? Give me a day or so to check in with my other agents. I'll assign you a partner in a lead then. Great. Thank you, Matthew. <sighs> Certainly. <sighs> Where is this all going? Hopefully we have a right direction. 
I think I'm actually getting better at this. Ooh, thanks, Eden. Thanks. Whoa, yeah, nice one, Zoe. Just trying my best. Well, right now, your best isn't exactly good enough by my standards. It's reassigning partners, everyone swap. Well, I guess. We'll be okay, Zoe. This phase won't last forever. Hopefully. <laughs> I know. Maybe someday Zarya won't be so disappointed in a lot of us. It's still our first day. We probably still got weeks of training before we do anything serious. Yeah, exactly. That's right. We've still got some time. Some time to focus and plan. Maybe by then, I'll feel a little more ready too. <laughs>